assets. At TFNN, educating investors. This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. And welcome all. It's a big day, and uh, we're off uh, three percent on the S and P. Nasdaq's off uh, three point, almost three point nine percent. Dow down two point seven percent. Russell off almost three percent. Crude oil, even it, has not been able to avoid the downside. Uh, down about seven tenths of a uh, percent. Gold off uh, one and a half percent. And of course, uh, what do we have today? Well, it's the results of the CPI. And my question of the day is, is there less blood in the stock markets today than Kill Bill Volume 2? I think it's a toss up. Other things going on that people are talking about, uh, Twitter whistleblower will be talking about that uh, on the show today. Uh, probably less to do about Twitter than a deal uh, between the uh, left and the right on regulation of uh, many of these uh, media stocks. And I didn't put it on there, but it's the uh, third thing of the day. And that is certainly uh, the, well, two things. In fact, I probably should have added two things. First rail strike on Friday. Uh, they're estimating about $2 billion a day to the economy if that goes through. Separately, we're looking on now to Wednesday of next week at 2 p.m., and that is when the Fed is going to come out with their next rate hike. Uh, after looking at the numbers this morning in the Tiger's Den, my first uh, blush opinion was uh, we'll look for 1% uh, interest rate hikes next Wednesday. And I would say that I, why I'm not uh, saying it's uh, more than 50%, it's probably close. See you in just a few minutes my show at 2. The reality is that navigating financial markets